All right, guys, let's get back into it. Let's put some more Neko Navy on the Type QQ Gaming channel. We are Death Difficulty. We are picking Kyrie, and we're going for that one CC, that one credit clear. Trying to rack up as many points, or rather, as many uh, extends and ones, one ups as we can um, before the game um, propels us out of this uh, mortal coil. A bit morbid, I guess, for uh, for a little kitty game, but you you know, I think uh, it doesn't take you too long in a, in a in sort of a shmup or bullet hell sort of lifestyle before you uh, you know you're pessimistic and. Uh, uh, ready to accept, um, you know, uh, an endless void of, 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 <laughs> of death's, and, death's embrace, I suppose. And for those who are just jumping on to the ne Neko Navy um, videos, so it's a, it's, a, it's a cool little cute shoot 'em up game, um, where you're trying to avoid being hit in that sort of pinkish white spot on the cat. However, my strategy looking playing into this game is that I'm going to try to collect all the sort of blue power-ups as I can until that sort of circle around the cat is completely full, like it is so. Then fire off my sort of multi-missile bomb to kind of convert all the shots and bad guys defeated into those orange power-ups. Those our orange power-ups are going to propel my points, hopefully into uh, more extra lives. Um, at least more lives than we actually die, or, or, or taken from us, rather. Ran into that sort of curtain right there. Um, I, I was letting that that power-up kind of sit around because that was going to be a, a sort of freebie. Instead of collecting a ton of uh, blue kitty points, we're just going to run into that power-up. Um, didn't necessarily go according to plan, and we're going to let that Ura flag or ticket thing uh, pass us by. We're going we're, we're, we're gonna to test that later. What I'd like to do is get a good amount of death mode um, under our uh, under our belts first. So unfortunately, we, we were made some made a stupid mistake in that first level. Um, but hopefully, we can rebound with this. Pretty good payout there, I would say. Maybe we could have waited a, a little bit longer. And I think for those guys as well, um, you know, if I come from a higher, higher, uh, higher point, I think you could get those missiles to collide with a lot more uh, enemy fire and turn into points. But yeah, we just picked up our uh, first extends, I believe. Yeah, I think so. So we're back up to default life. I mean that's the thing about um, death mode is is although it's um, a larger amount of well I wouldn't say larger amount of difficulty I don't know if that's the correct word to say but it's certainly a uh, higher and it's a lot more harder um, and certainly more a lot more aggressive um, they are going to fire more bullets at you so if you have that sort of bomb ready to go um, it's going to feed your you know um, extends engine as it were a lot. Uh, a lot quicker as well. Making some real lucky dodges there. Was able to even kill part of the boss even before the, the fight even started. So, so you know, I'll certainly take that trade. You know, we made a silly mistake in the first boss, but played the second boss pretty well. And and making another extends, you can see with that that pink two as the points roll over into that and 55% into the next one. And this is kind of the trickiness, is that without a bomb, um, we have to kind of weather a lot of the, uh, most of the difficulty, or most of the harder parts of death mode. You know, we have to get through some really interesting and difficult patterns um, without dying or, and until we get to, you know, a bomb. Like, at this point, we can kind of start a dom domino effect of, you know, shooting down some enemies, um, getting a bomb ready. And then yeah, and then go, and then and then just you know, hopefully carry it through the through the level, waiting for a lot of 
bullets and enemies to kind of come on screen. Get a nice pale like that. Brings us very close to our third extent. There it is, there's our third there. So in a, in a way, where we're, we're taking and turning all this extra aggression and difficulty the game is putting towards us, or, or yeah, or displaying towards us, and turning it into bonus points. You know, there's no way in other, any other difficulty that we'd have three extents um, already. It's just that's how much extra fire and extra nonsense is going on on the screen. And you just kind of, you know, and that's kind of my strategy is to, uh, you know, familiarize myself with it and kind of see it coming. Kind of leave myself um, prepared to bomb anything. And that's the thing is, like, I don't necessarily want to pick these up. You know, um, all those, those, blue, uh, those blue, blue kitty cat points. Um, when I was, I had, I had full, um, full bomb, you know, because it's kind of a waste. And I'm not sure what exactly I was waiting there for to do. Kind of silly and kind of stupid. Um, luckily, uh, no, not luckily, you know, we actually kind of messed ourselves up. However, as some weird bit of fate, you know, like dying there, and we actually picked up a, like a secret one up there, um, which is, I guess if we have to remember, like that second sort of closing vice thing um, before the stage ends. And oddly enough, that's never happened for you because you kind of saw how that uh, um, achievement popped up. So, you know, make make a stupid mistake and, you know, find a little Easter egg, I guess. So, I guess no harm, no foul, except for the fact that, you know, I guess in, in, in future runs, you know, we'll know it's there. And I suppose if there's any um, level to really make it up, it's certainly going to be this one. Um, like we covered in the past, you have these like sort of sausage hot dog things here on the top of the screen that you can just melt with your uh, um, with your special attack when you're picked up enough uh, pickups there. Maybe a little premature there. But oh well. I'm not going to really fret too much. Sitting at five lives right now. Really could be worse. Considering... Um, if you're taking our extends and our defaults, we should be at six lives. So that extra, you know, Easter egg um, one up certainly does help. Almost, almost found myself uh, eating a bullet there. I'm not so sure I can really uh, claim I knew how to dodge it. Not quite, yeah, not quite going to make it there, so we're just going to pick that up. We, we could fight with the boss to get the uh, extra points, and maybe that was a, maybe it would have been right there as well. But I figured, uh, I figured there's no sense we can start the, st start the boss fight with a big attack. He got, he got killed right there. I'm not sure exactly what, what it was. Maybe it was one of those um, purple rocket-like things. Didn't quite really see it then, and didn't really kind of see it now, but I'm sure it was there. Picked up another extends, and 24% into the next. And sadly, that's kind of what my strategy is right now. Until we can kind of uh, get good, I guess. <laughs> I guess is the best. Is the uh, Stupid. That, absolutely stupid. I, I, I should have known that a bazillion times. We've done this level a million times where you're supposed to hang low. I don't know what the, what the fuck I was doing there. That was brainless. Um, as I was saying, um, yeah, um, my strategy right now, until I can get good, is to kind of... 
outpunch the game. You know, get more extends than I'm giving away. Kind of some evasive moves there. It's some I don't really necessarily want to make because that just you just risking r risking death. But that's kind of how you, how it works if you don't kind of have a bomb like this in the sort of canister, ready to go. Back up to five lives. Gonna leave that power up, just bounce a bit, I think. Yeah, pretty awesome stuff. And unfortunately, that was a, a pretty, pretty garbage bomb, but I just had a sort of that. You know, that sort of big cloud of blue pickups, you know, crawling up, you know, coming right up on me, so I didn't necessarily want to waste, you know, waste them, you know, it's kind of like I was going to walk into a free bomb anyway, so I thought maybe, hey, if there was enemies coming my way, fire a bomb, but there wasn't any enemies, so kind of a missed bomb, but, you know, it really didn't turn out to be any sort of, um, yeah, it didn't really turn into anything. So now we are against uh, Goldie here. Um, one of the easier bosses I find in the game. There's only one thing that we, playing as um, Kyrie that we really need to worry about is that that iron ball that kind of shows up and ooh, that was a bad bad move. That iron ball there. So so what we're doing instead of just pumping the, uh, the boss with as much damage as we can, we're kind of holding back, reserving our uh, bomb for just that moment when that iron ball comes coming towards us because I don't think we have the sort of strength right in front of our uh, our, sh our ship as it were to project the ball as we should like other characters can and sadly we didn't really get that sort of bonus point kill on the boss either really not the best uh, best boss fight there but what can you do what can you do you can't win them all So, so far in like most in all the uh, boss fights except for the, the second one which usually it, um, causes some sort of difficulty we've had some sort of little mix-ups in all the bosses but we're still sitting at five lives however um you know this is this is where the game really starts um, um, really starts cranking up the difficulty especially with the boss the boss the boss is certainly going to be the biggest test on this mode um, and certainly was the first um, wow just chaos chaos and bound yeah you can hear the click there where I was hoping I could get a bomb got off before I before I got hit but it just wasn't there. But as I was saying, um, the boss of this level is certainly the first boss of 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 true like challenge, you know, and and, and game over threatening challenge. You know, we've been able able to make um, um, easy work of them on easy and hard, but um, we had a f our first run in death mode. Um, we just were just completely unplugged by him, you know, just showed up and died. So hopefully we can do a little bit better than that. Losing another life, and this is, yeah, this is kind of... Yeah. Luckily it looks like we've got a big payout coming here, hopefully. Yeah. So back up to four lives. Oop. That was, that's kind of it. Click. Click no, uh, no bomb there, so... Got punished. Punched there. Oh, and again, playing really aggressive, trying to get through these patterns, getting around the enemy. 
um, to get that to get the the full to get a bomb and uh, at least in that that point we just didn't pick up enough points. Kind of the same same deal there, and we're down to one life. Just picked up our uh, picked up another one there, so two lives. And here we are. that sort of constant barrage of, of weapons kind of following you there. There are those p purple shots. Those purple shots are going to follow you and make you move back and forth. And and yet there's just no there's just no uh, no space. And we did a little bit better, but not by much. You know, I think we did just as poor as last time. We just had a couple more men to, to die. So instead of dying in five seconds, we died three times in 15 seconds. But, uh, We'll certainly give it another go. I think that's going to be a big hurdle to, to jump over, but I think we can do it in time. So don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment, and we'll be at this again sometime very soon.